I'm Rose Collis. Um, I'm the writer of the play. Uh, it's based on my book, Colonel Barker's Monstrous Regiment, and I am, for this rehearsed reading, playing Colonel Sir Victor Barker, DSO, a.k.a. Valerie Arkell-Smith, a.k.a. etc., etc. How did you get to know about Barker? Oh, that goes way back, um, back to 1995 when I was researching another book and I found a cutting about Barker and I thought, ooh, what an amazing story, file for future use. And uh, a few years later, I had an idea of doing the book, telling as much of the whole story as I could. Um, the book came out in 2001, got great reviews. Um, there's been various talks about people turning it into film and doing it on the stage. And finally this year, I thought, I want to adapt it for the stage and uh, here we are. My name is Philippa Hammond and I'm reading the role of Elfrida Howard who is a nice young lady living in very dull 1920s Littlehampton working in her parents chemist shop and into that very boring life walks this six foot tall fencing, boxing, Elvis Presley look-alike charmer who basically captures her heart and invites her to go and live with him at the Grand Hotel in Brighton. And if, if that was you, what would you do? So, of course, she jumps at the chance. The very next day after he's moved in, off she goes. Only all is not as it seems, and we discover Colonel Barker's secret. But the interesting thing is, does she know Barker's secret. My name is Keith Drinkle. I'm playing Sir Ernest Wilde KC, former MP and now judge of this case. So what, what sort of a role does the judge play in it? Well, he is in a way, I suppose you could say he's the, he's the moral centre of the piece. He uh, believes in, you know, uh, he believes that women are uh, young and innocent and charming and should know their place. Uh, he also had, was rather strangely eccentric. He and his wife used to attend parties dressed as Napoleon and, and Josephine. So, but although he's slightly eccentric, I think he has a moral code which he believes in. And judging this particular case of a man or a woman married to a woman uh, goes against all his beliefs. But I think he's actually not an unfair judge. He's all right. Uh, my name's Guy Wah. I'm playing the compere uh, in The Trials of Colonel Barker, um, and the compere is the person who uh, helps narrate the story. The compere uh, has an interesting relationship with Barker. Uh, his only real interest in Barker is that he can uh, sell him as a freak show to try and make some money from him. There are some moments where there's a bit of uh, genuine uh, concern and, and contact, but I think underneath it all, the compere is only interested in telling the story for the audience.